Okay, so I found a way in. I just had to climb over that wall there. I figured out how to get in off camera, and then as soon as I literally, I just found out how to do it, and then I just started it from the last part. So now we're going to get in here and get the spider bot in our points and the mask over here. There's plenty of things to grab in these uh, bases here. Now, I don't know if these people are going to cause an uproar. I like that mask, though. I'm glad I came in here now. What? I was crouched. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, fuck off. This game's trash. That's a big fuck you, dude. Like, when did I stand up? That uh, That is annoying. I don't know when I stood up, bro. When did I do that? Fuck, man. I was against the thing, and then all of a sudden, I just stood up. Like, what fucking game is this? I guess I'm in a fucking firefight now. Arm trap. I shouldn't have been in a firefight at fucking all. I gotta reload. Now everybody's on me. Great. Great fucking game. Right when I start to give this game credit. I get fucked over by Ubisoft's shitty fucking stealth, unless it's Assassin's Creed. I'm unless it's Assassin's Creed, don't do stealth, bro. Don't fucking do it. Clearly you're incompetent at it. Okay, now they're all good. Now, you can see I'm crouched. You can see that I'm fucking crouched. If I stand up one more time, bro. If it makes me stand up one more time. Involuntarily. Which is something that shouldn't have happened. It shouldn't have happened. I don't get this game. Okay, pick it up. We're gonna let this guy out, aren't we? Yeah, rescue. You're free, brother. You're free. Rescue freedom fighter. Where am I trapped? Because why not? There we go. I think you just made a new friend. Nice. If you wanted to lock them up, they must be dangerous. And dangerous we can use. Correct. Got my points, bitches. Alright, where's the spider bot? He's over here. What the hell? What the hell was he so exhausted from? Did you see him? And how come he wasn't on my fucking radar? Okay, we got another spider bot. Fuck out of here. I have it. Scanning Spybot and accessing its internal drives. While I'm analyzing this data, you should make yourself scarce. Unless you'd like to explain to your new, heavily armed, privatized police force why you've broken into the station. Fine. The Spiderbot fragment you found has a satellite based GPS module that regularly pushed its location to a specific ground station. Strange. Why would the police force use another station? Unless it's off the books. Pushing you the ground station's coordinates. Investigate the ground station, okay. Vault. My vehicle should be over here somewhere. Oh, there's the bitch that ran in front of my car. 
Oh, Borderlands 3 versions, whatever. I got an update <laughs> during this video. Uh... I don't want an Albion car. Well, I might have no choice. Okay, so let's go to our tech, because we might be able to get the silencer right now. Damn it! Okay, I needed to get the upgrade, so yeah, I'll just get the upgrade. So now I only need 15 more points to get a silencer. So we needed to, we needed to get that anyway. I thought I needed way less points for that. So we're going to, again, drive over. In the next couple of videos, I'll probably just edit them out. Just to keep a fresh feel. Where it's not always me just driving or me just editing. I usually like to make... I'm going to try to mix it up. I'll edit out some of the drive drives over there. If they're, if they're really long, then I'll just edit it out. But... If it's somewhere where it's only like a kilometer away, we'll 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 take it over there. But this one isn't that far. Pretty much around the corner. A few blocks up. Look at that, more points. Just what we need. Just what we need. Is there a way if to it's points, I want it. I'm detecting a surveillance network guarding a space under this bridge. If you can patch into it, perhaps you can take a look inside. The GPS history of the spider bot we recovered regularly pinged these coordinates. Our mystery witness to the real bombers must have come to this lovely... Sorry, Bagley, cut you off. ...location several times. Hello. It's discreet in a camera dead zone. Good place to conduct some less than legal business. Or to discreetly dump a body into the Thames. I don't think I've seen the last of these. Okay, destroying a circuit box will unlock connected devices, but may alert guards. Was well, there any guards around here? Don't look like it. Shit, there is. Where? Didn't I just destroy the circuit box? The fuck is wrong with this game? I destroyed it, didn't I? I shot it! Did I not shoot it with fucking bullets? Or whatever this gun is. Electric gun, whatever the fuck. It's like I'm playing fucking Batman. I don't even got fucking r bullets. It's just fucking like shock shit. Whatever the fuck. Fuck you. Oh, look at that. Now I'm wanted. Great. Look, you can see me shooting it, right? You can see me shooting it. I'm, I'm destroying the box. I don't understand what this game means by destroying the box. That's it. I'm doing it. Just fucking kill me, bro. Get, get, me, off. get me off. Let me restart. Because you're telling me to do something that I can't do. Yes, kill me. Kill me. I'm switching operatives, bro. Because that made no fucking sense to me. Good, I'm glad you're fucking arrested. I'm fucking glad you are. Um. She is fast hacking, right? This game's fucking pissing me off. Your friend's just been taken into Albion custody. So long as you don't cock up that badly, you'll be my favorite operative today. I'm always cleaning up these hotheads' messes. Let's be off, then. Well, I did I did what the game told me to do, and then it fucked me over, so... I mean, the game's great. Right. 
It wants me to destroy that, not the fucking keypad? So I fucked up. I'll hold on to that one. I don't give a shit. I had no choice but to do that, though. Good lord. The police have a whole office down here in their little troll cave. Well, if Albion was stomping all over your workplace, you'd find a different place to store your lunch, too. And it seems our mystery officer was dedicated. Do you have any idea who put them onto the trail of the tone attack? The computer's dusty enough to kill an asthmatic, but there may still be something useful on it. This is Inspector Caitlin Lau. Well, former inspector now since Albion's crew, the Met is no more. The police brass had already buried the evidence anyway. Everything implicating Albion and Clan Kelly in the bombings. But I know Mary Kelly's band of twats were involved, and they're involved in other crimes we can look into. Me and a few good mates are willing to go off book, going after Mary Kelly again. I'll never fucking learn, will I? Take that, computer. Inspector Caitlin Lau, video log. Clan Kelly and Albion are teamed up on some deal. I don't have all the details, but it looks to be human trafficking. The European Processing Center is the Albion angle. Since the bombings, they can grab anyone off the street. Call them illegal immigrants, potential dead sick insurgents, whatever. Though we know who the real danger is. So, Clan Kelly gets hold of these people, these... Immigrants, deportees, victims, really, and they're taking them somewhere. But where and why? <laughs> it all comes back to the boss lady herself. I knew she was into something, but she wriggled off the hook. There's only one way I can do this. 24-7 surveillance on Mary Kelly. If I'm caught, well, this will be my last entry. But I have to see what she's hiding. So, our mystery officer was Inspector Caitlin Lau. It sounds like Mary Kelly was her white way. And her investigation led her to the bombings. First Albion, and now these Kelly thugs. Does anyone want to give it a bloody rest? It seems like Zero Day's web covers all of the unsavory bits of London. Tug on a thread, and it leads back to them. Clank Kelly and Albion included. Now people are being snatched off the street? Putting a stop to this is why I joined DedSec. Inspector Lau mentioned Albion is running their part of the operation out of the EPC. Detectives like us call that a lead. Nice, I got points for completing the mission as well. Now I can get my silencer. What the hell? Sure thing, okay. No, I guess. Get in the no way out of this for you, mate. I mean. <gasps> this Albion Why Clan Kelly business leaves a bad taste in my mouth. And if Caitlin Lau's right, then this little nugget jumps to the front of the. Yeah, I gotta rescue these people. We have reason to believe a former dead sec operative. Other bookies. Alive, but missing. <clears throat> the EPC. Angel Rescue Lopez. you guys. Not London born, but I won't hold back against him, unlike some others. Looks like Angel got caught up in the immigration roundup, which, ironically, may be the only reason he escaped Zero Day's dead sec purge. Anti-immigrant sentiment has grown in London since the bombings. Albion fuels it. It allows them to send anyone they want to their brutal refugee camp. We need to find Angel before okay. we discover he's dead sec. This is kind of personal team. But finding his trail might just shed some light on the Albion Clan Kelly connection. Shit. Well, the good news is he's in country. No one's taking deportees from the UK. The bad news is he's probably in limbo at the EPC. 
I've sent the details to your device and advised our contact at the EPC. They can get you inside. Okay, so we done talking now? We done? <laughs> All right, um, I'll keep this part nice and short. I want to do a lot of stuff off cam just so I can get a lot of... teammate has got themselves thrown in the old clink, I'm afraid. Difficult to resist oppression from behind bars. It will be a while before they're available. Pro tip, however, why not recruit a barrister to the team? I mean, no one exactly likes a barrister, but they do have their function. They should be able to shorten the jail time of imprisoned operatives. Motherfucker cut me off again, so I'm going to do a lot of things offline, so I'm just going to keep this part nice and short for you guys since the last part was, I think, over 30 minutes, not too much over. Um, so, hope you guys enjoyed part 8. I will see you in part 9.